Today, more than 200 military veterans volunteered their time to bring a park to Houston's East End, all while honoring those who served and sacrificed in the wake of the September 11th attacks. Channel 2's Roseanne Aragon has the story. 18 years after an incident that changed history, we have hundreds of veterans determined to show what can happen when communities come together. This is camaraderie. You're kind of just happy to be out here around other veterans. Compassion. We're here to give back because we're servants for our military and servants for here in the community. And remembrance. It's the responsibility of all people, I think even more importantly the veterans who are, have served and sacrificed so much to be a reminder. Remembering the people who lost their lives in a moment that changed history by highlighting the resilient spirit of Americans. These are all my brothers and sisters. We're out here in a community that needs help. This one's a little longer. That's what this is about. It's bringing communities together. The mission continues as a nonprofit helping veterans utilize their skills in a different way. As part of the United in Service campaign, the nonprofit is partnering with the East End District to transform this area in need. Today we are building a park, like from the ground up. Teamwork makes the dream work. This weekend we're actually building a butterfly garden, putting in benches and putting in trees. Before we started working out here, the weeds will grow seven feet tall. Uh, this is a dead end street leading up to a railroad track. So this place was used as a dumping ground. Saturday. Got these flower beds going on to my left and they're making this uh, walkway right here. These veterans alongside foreign exchange students and community members are putting their skills to the test. Creating a park accessible to the elderly and safe for children. And some echinacea, cone flowers, uh, milkweed. A park made through a service of love, which means so much to veterans like Tony DeLeon. I was at the Pentagon station in the, uh, in the Army staff at the time, so it, it comes back full circle and now we're giving back to the community. He says this park stands for honor. United. From the East End, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News.